This is the Modular Minute, and this is Maths from Make Noise. Today we're going to talk about one of the basic uses of maths, an attack decay envelope. This simple type of two-stage envelope is a forever useful tool in synthesis. The attack parameter defines how long it takes for a voltage to change from 0 volts to positive 10 volts, and the decay defines how long it takes for it to get back from 10 volts to 0 volts. This knob down here, labeled log and exp, short for logarithmic and exponential, Describe the shape of that curve. If you set the knob to this line, you get a linear curve, like a triangle waveform. Exponential curves, for example, are good for short plucky bass sounds. The maths, in particular, is useful because it has two outputs for this channel. The first, down here, is the full range of the signal. The second option is this output labeled 1, the range of which is determined by this attenuverter at the top. If you turn it all the way clockwise, you get the full signal range, but as you move back towards center, you start to scale back the output until it's completely attenuated. If you go past center, you invert the signal towards a negative 10 volts instead of positive 10. One other note, using this output removes it from the summing bus down here, but we'll talk about that later. Oh, and channel 4 behaves exactly the same as channel 1 with one small exception. Stay tuned and follow us for more insight into the world of synthesis and sound design.